Can Ukraine win the unwinnable war? Possibly, but only with the West's help, specifically the United States. But not the help that we think we're going to give them, the help that we haven't even thought of yet. Right now, Ukraine is fighting a war with Russia in which they're fighting a World War One era style. World War One era style war. Which means there's a front line that basically doesn't budge and hundreds of thousands of soldiers are going to die there. Hundreds of thousands already have died there. Hundreds of thousands or more will in order to try to get even the smallest bits of land. And it's stalled completely for months now. It has not moved. It's a little bit too, a little bit that. Do that, think that that's it. And every time it was a drop, tens of thousands of soldiers died. But Ukraine has proven that this is not the way that war should be fought. The way war should be fought is very simply. You manufacture, have huge manufacturing plants, you manufacture millions of cheap few hundred dollar drones. You put a grenade or an RPG in the middle of it, and then you just go and you send it out and you hit your target. It explodes and it causes massive damage. These drones, with enough of them, can even take out tanks, they can take out huge buildings, they can take out anything really, but with enough of them. They can take down airports. Oh my gosh. So, this is the future of modern warfare. It's not one big drone that costs $300 million, it's millions of tiny little drones. And your troops are far away from the front lines. That's how warfare should be fought from now on. If you look at what the U.S. is actually going to be giving Ukraine in this bill that has not passed, none of it is this. We have no manufacturing for this. The Ukrainians are manufacturing these small little tiny paper drones themselves, and they have a very limited capability to keep on creating them, and they have to basically crowdsource the funding to create the drones that they are making because again the US is not funding this at all. The US is completely ignoring this. On the flip side, China right now has looked into Ukraine, saw what they're doing, and are now creating special drone units with the design with the function of having first person drones. That's an FPV. You put the the VR glasses on and you can actually steer it with the camera. And it feels like you're actually flying it <coughs> and uh, they've learned from ukraine and now they're doing this and they've created actual drone units that are designed to have a huge unit each one having a drone you have a spotter you have a hitter and the spotter directs the drone says hey you're 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 at the target you're good that's what's happening and the hitter goes and hits the target and it's really effective and with enough of them it can overwhelm even the biggest forces. So let's say Russia has a million troops at, I don't know the exact number, but let's just say a million for argument's sake at that front line. If Ukraine was going to go and take 30, 40, 50,000 troops, equip them with these, these cheap drones and say, okay, 12 o'clock AM, everyone send out your drones. And boom, between 12 AM and 12, 10 AM, 50,000 drones are fired at the Russians. They would be completely overwhelmed. There's nothing they can do about it. There's no, at least that we, ha that we have today, there is no um, defense system that can take them down. In the future, we're going to have the laser drone, the laser systems that can take down drone after drone after drone, just keep on taking them down. Uh, we don't have those then. We don't have those yet. It doesn't really exist. It exists, but it's not effective. And so, of course, it's not effective at any front line. And so this is the way to actually beat Russia with their endless amounts of troops. It's with massive, very cheap drones. So someone has to go to the US and say, hi, uh, this is a new way how to fight wars. But until then, uh, Ukraine can't win. This is the only way for Ukraine to win the war. And they keep, they're going to keep on trying. But you see these drone attacks. Russia does not know how to, how to beat them. Every time Ukraine has a drone attack inside of Russia, they go completely unopposed. They hit their targets and then destroy them. So uh, let's hope that you, you, the United States gets on board this. This is an actual way to beat Russia.